Y'all acting real crackish today, my nigga, my Kruger. So who are you? So now that guy calls and his name is Jennifer. You know what? Either you Latinos, Hispanics, Indians, or whatever you be, y'all done fucked around with the wrong G. Nah, bitch. You trolling me? Nah, I'm going to troll you back. And I hope that the military clocks every single one of you before. I told you I got time today. All you motherfuckers I'm putting on display. So this number now is what? 9108652922. I know they're burner phones. I really do. And I know you don't have nothing else to do. But bitch, I will fuck you up. I really will. And it's true. And I can do it in a variety of ways. Did you see the white cat come by me today? So who wants to talk to me now? Is that Bobby? Is it Sylvia? Is it who? Is it you? Is that my neighbors? I better not be. It better not be you. Bitch, I'm right beside you. You know I could knock on your door. What you gonna do about it? Especially when the military and more are watching me. So what you gonna do? Everybody ain't got shit to do but to call me and I'm just minding my own business and I just see I just saw the plane going through but you don't know who you're messing with do you boo you want to play that shit with me today now nah, I'm shitting on you shitty 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 bitch maybe I'm gonna be the witch so let's do this number one more time why don't you answer the phone either it's busy or whatever then why don't you leave me alone you ain't got nothing else to better do you ain't got a chick to fuck or a brother to suck it's that part though what's up Chuck what's up what's up What's up? Is that part? What's up? What's up? What's up? You still ain't getting your Bitcoin money. You know what? You're trying to drive somebody crazy, and I can, and I'm turning back. I'm turning the game back on you. You must hate me now, not as much as I hate you. But I'm really playing with you like a cat plays with a mouse. Well, anyway, what was the number again? Nine one zero eight six five twenty nine twenty two. Let's see if we're gonna answer. Will you, Jennifer? That's the man. Of course you won't. Are we going to be doing this all day? Is that what you're going to do? You know I could just unplug the goddamn phone. I'm not Kanye. I'm not Kendrick. I'm not any of these motherfuckers. In fact, you know what? Whether you leave me alone or not, I can just unplug the phone and go about my day. But if you knock on my house and I got that private property on display, I can shoot your ass. I know that I got that from a cop. So what the fuck are you talking about? Just what you guys are doing. Keep calling me up. You know what? That is really sad that you're so out of luck. My God. Gosh, are you so jealous and so lonely? Don't you have money to make? Clearly you don't. You fakey ass fake. What? Are we hillsonging today? Are you some crazy ass cracker or some nigga trying to come my way? Are you some crazy ass Spanish or Latino Cuban too? Bitch, who the fuck are you? Maybe we should be asking who the fuck am I? Will you look me eye to eye? Do we need to match guns? <laughs> one is for shooting and one is for fun. <laughs> it's that part. Ooh, shall I start calling out names? Ooh, is it Q? Is it you? Better not be, because I'm telling you, I don't know who it be. I done put, I have done put the security on. And I don't you have some type, like, you know, the, the, the thing, what's that called? You dummies don't know. But there's still a tracer even on the burn, on the burner phones. So anyway, either way, when you tap into me, you're already tapped in. The second I say hello, it's like a snapshot click. And in just a second, they can trace where you're at. You didn't know that, did you? Cause you stupid. You better you better tell the truth today. Cause the FBI could be coming your way. You know what? It's not even me. I'm not that important. But you're messing with government money. Sad when the government is doing that too. Maybe it's the mayor. What mayor could it be? I don't think the mayor in Spring Lake. Because the mayor in Spring Lake, I think, I would hope, actually likes me. I'm just minding out my business and a good abiding, a good abiding citizen. I don't know about the mayors in Fayetteville. Well, that's a whole nother submission and position. Mm. I said what I said, what I said, what I said. Pause for the cause. We're on a world tour. So, y'all, <laughs> industry. Y'all want to put on an industry show? If I hear any of my raps on anybody's song, I'm coming personally, yo. You won't even know who I be because I'll be like the ghost. Oh, I know you do the old. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> and you know what? This chick's on YouTube. There's one chick. She is, like, so scared. She doesn't know what to do. When you 
when you wait, when you like, because now I'm monitoring y'all like you clearly monitoring me, but you don't know what you see. I'm the authority. That's all. Just doing me. But when you see these, when th this child looks so scared, she should be blinking her eyes. Like, listen, then why are you doing it? Did they catch you in that trap? Did they catch you in that telegraph trap? Did they catch you in like, listen, we'll tell everybody you did this and you did that. So I want to see your tits and I want to say, you got to work for me. You got to do, they're forcing you to show your shit. If you do that, the kids, I'm sure you have, bitch. I'm going to make it my job personally to find a root. I, no, I'm not going to do nothing. Mommy said pull back. Daddy's on that. Okay. You done messed with the wrong chick. And you still like a crackhead whore. Still trying to suck on my dick. My dick's bigger than yours. <laughs> they hate that shit. <laughs> Can't you see whatever you do to me, it makes my creativity goes times 300. Set to 300. What, 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 somebody going to be working on the railroad. No, somebody going to be working on the coal mines, going downtown, down, working on the coal. I don't remember how that song is, but it's something like that. Anyway, are we going to be doing this all day? Because you see, I just go on and on and on and on and on like the ever ready bunny. Does she ever run out of poems? No, because it's all in me. And I still haven't had coffee yet or CBD. But thank you to the postman. Shout out to the people who do real business. And it's that part. I'm about real business, but I'm not about fraud business. I'm not about stalking business. I'm not about pedophilic business. I'm not about people stealing somebody's identity. And I very much am very, hashtag living astrology. I'm very much appreciative of the grandparents who watch over me. I'm very much appreciative of the fact that I really did have a grandmother that was buried in Jernigan Warren. So you know what, I'm whatever I am. But either way, it doesn't matter right now because everybody's going to see me as this. And I don't give a damn. If you KKK, bitch, you will be my bitch. Don't play with me. When I'm a really smart chick, don't play with me. And if you a stupid ass nigga on that on on that nature boy shit, bitch, I will come for you and glock you up real quick. You wanna play Tupac on me? Then I go Suge Knight. Am I kidding? Why don't you ask my neighbors? Why don't you ask them? Am I kidding? I'm not J Cole. I'm not Wes. I'm not Willow Smith. I'm not playing for YouTube views. I'm not Will Smith. I'm not front like I'm a gangster. I'm not into weird shit. I hear the birds singing outside. Birds sing at funerals too. Could one of these funerals be you? I'm just saying, you know what? Why don't you stop doing... And Jada, are you that stupid? Shouldn't you about be dead by now? I'm just saying, really. I mean, I don't know. My apologies if it's not you. But I just... It's, it's just the energy. Y'all trying... Somebody's trying to August Alcina me and Angie Stone me too. Quincy... Mr. Jones, Mr. Jones, Mr. Jones, uh, Incognito, what was the name of that song? Yeah, it's like, were you talking about you? I'm just saying, I really don't care at this moment what you do. I don't have nothing to do with any of you. My point is, why are you still trying to mind fuck or gang stalk me? First off, you need a real mind, G. Your pussy and your dick ain't gonna get this. But my Glock would love to say, I'm just, do I need to show that again? It's legal, my friend. And did I remind you, you want to see the goat? You know, you know, how would I, how would, how would, a, how would a nerdy kid like me know what gold dots do? That's why I said, I don't negotiate with terrorists. When I shoot you, you're going to go down. I don't give a damn how much drugs you want. I specifically wanted to know. Do I, you know what? I need to show them again. If you're friends of these hoes, you better let them know in real life, go to Guns Plus. They trained me. They're good people. I like them. I did this. This was during the Trump regime when they were trying to get everybody black and white against each other. Black people against white people. Da, 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 da. And here the little old, uh, here the little old Ranger Manger girl in my dreadlocks coming in with all these white boys. And I didn't know how they would treat me. Because reminding you the fact when y'all were getting cutting everybody's hair off, I said, my hair, and I know India already said, I am not my hair. But in this case, I am my hair. Because this hair reminded me that I should not, I should not hate everybody that has locks. Because people who had lots killed my husband. This community 
failed. I took it personally. I've always been an activist for you. I've always served you. But because I don't suck anybody's ass, you want to play me like I'm a fool. Bitch, I don't know who the fuck you think I am. But I'm not scared of any of you. So I don't give a damn if you the chief of police or the head of Hootie Who. Bitch, you come for me. I'm coming for you. Don't play a real Top Gun chick, okay? You playing with the military, too. Honestly, I'm trying to tell you guys just what's going to happen and what's going to happen to you. You think these gang members are going to protect you when the military turns? You think the industry going to protect you when the military turns? You think your mayor, your mayor and your pre they're going to be running and hiding because they know they're going to be the first ones to get burned. No, I'm not doing a Trump thing right now. I'm just saying it's that type of setup that you're trying to flip it all around. And I'm the good kid. I've always been the good kid the best kid in town perhaps the smartest kid in town clearly i'm smart now because some of you who are supposedly sound businessmen and businesswomen and teachers and preachers you too have taken the damn tea and you know i mean more than just a vaccine oh yeah mm-hmm that telegraph shit that gonna come back to you you want to put all the guns and eyes on me now all the guns and eyes are on you happy 911 who's getting shot down it won't be me let me tell you one time before i take care of me who do i listen to who do i follow my mommy and my daddy my parents are grd god -E -S -S. I don't know your parents. I don't know your God, but I know your God is a fraud because my God told me to get away from this mess because it was all about to go down. Revelations is here. Can't you hear the sound? Gabriel is blowing her horn today. Yes, I said Archangel Gabriel. Maybe it's just foreplay. Maybe it's just gameplay. Either way, what made you think the angels don't slay? Oh, you wait for Hathor and Blue Ivy. And I'm not hating, bitch, to you. Slay, ho, slay. But listen, let me tell you, crackhead mama, or whoever's doing witchcraft on me today, and again, I apologize, sister, if that's not you, but we all know some of you, and I'm including Erica Badu, and even Riri, too. We all know, you know, some of you from the islands in Texas and Louisiana, you do that hoodoo voodoo shit. You know, salute to all the men, which I never knew why. Not a damn one of them wanted me to go to uh, Mardi Gras. No one. I have always wanted to go to Mardi Gras, and all all the men in my life went no. Husband went no. Both husbands went no. All my male friends went no. They go. But me no. I'm like, why don't you want me to go to Mardi Gras? Why come I can't have the Mardi Gras? Because they know exactly where I'm going to go. Where the first place I will ever like be that. What you worried about? That I'm going to be like, what was that movie? Ease by you? You think that's going to happen to me? <laughs> What do you see in me? I don't know. Anyway, I'm showing some people again because some people think I pretend. And again, I wasn't pretending when I went to Guns Plus and these wonderful people. When you were with everybody, when the whole world was turning sus, you were having whites against black and blacks against whites and nobody couldn't trust nobody. But you know, when you've grown up in the country and I'm like, I really, I really didn't have that. I really, you know, the it's sad to say that the biggest enemy to me. That is such a horrible thing. That's why I say I'm not afraid of the KKK. This bitch is better not mess with me, okay? 1918, my ass. Your boy was a confused Jew. So what the fuck you gonna do? You better read you. I'm not doing anything to you. So you can walk and do whatever you do. I told you, I make the devil smile. I mean, you know, you don't think I know what you were doing out there? Or maybe you just wanted to see. I'm flirting black and then they flirted back at me. I told you, I can make a, I can make a gay man straight. <laughs> I can make a KKK go, damn, I like her. <laughs> oh, I just turned, I just turned a white supremacist into a nigga lover. Because I rep with authenticity. I rep with integrity. I rep with intelligence. They love the intelligence in me. I'm not a dumb negress. And don't you ever in your entire life think that you are better or superior to me. Compared to what? You don't even know you following a confused you. What are you basing your legacy on? What type of, what type of dumb shit? Are, now you're mad. 
Now you may, are you confused? Then you know what? How about we all band together right now because the government is making us all lose. Don't you have kids? Don't you like life? Would you like to die behind a lie tonight? I don't think you do. So can I talk to the real intelligence in all of you, whether you are a, a black militant or a white mill or whatever you be, you all have children. And since we're in this country, who is taking our money and who is trying to fraud identity me? Who is the real alien in Area 53? Mm -hmm. Classified. Who's the real Top Gun chick? I don't know. All I know is it's sweating. I'm in the hottest room. I'm in the hottest room in the house. All I know is when y'all were like really trying to fake us all out. And I said, man, I'm going to really need to do something because I don't trust anybody. And I went to these people. And, um, and I literally had a PTSD moment. I went to these people and, and we were in the height of the pandemic and everything. And, uh, you know, people had on masks and this and what did, did they? No, some did and some did. No, by this time, you know, by this time, some of us like, we didn't give a fuck. So if you, by this time, some were wearing masks, some were not because we realized, oh, this is bullshit. So, uh, but they were behind the bar and everything. Yeah. I mean, you know, you, you, you know, the partition or whatever you, you're kind of doing a thing because you're in business. So I got it. But anyway, so, um, and so I'm looking at, and I'm, and I'm telling them, uh, no, wait, I went in and I was telling them what I needed. And, uh, oh, I'm having a moment right now. It never goes away. That's why you better tell these Hollywood types. You better tell these gangster types. You better tell them my PTSD is real. Motherfuckers, I will kill you dead instantly i wish i will load the whole motherfucking clip on you because i still have ptsd from seeing my husband's blood go into the go into the carolina ground i'm not the one you wanna fuck with okay and i'm not crazy i'm just sick and goddamn tired when the whole the whole community let me down the whole legal service let me down Thank you, Detective Terrence Phillips, for doing what you do because you, 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 and thank you, Shafana, too. And I hope these motherfuckers didn't get you, you know, you didn't, didn't get either of you because they seemed to target the people that had anything to do with me, especially if you had an idea. That's what the devil would do, man. Y'all would think that the, the devil will come to you really, really is interesting. You would think the devil, remember you said the devil will come as a, a, as a, as a being, a nice person of life. What is it that you want? I can give you whatever you want. So maybe somebody wanted to be a star or somebody wanted to be this. I only wanted to be me. I only wanted justice for my husband i still mm, mm. but i realized this community was never going to give me that so at the end of the day it had to be justice for me i mean you know i guess my husband was working out his own generational curses and that and i and whatever it is either way it taught me how you know i don't depend on nobody i i i make sure i have my back because i've had too many things stripped from me to ever just depend on anybody be codependent on anybody i depend on me and g-o-d-d-e-s-s -S. what would jesus do me so anyway when i went to um uh when i went to guns plus because i realized these people are acting like zombies for real so fuck alice in wonderland i'm getting ready to go kill bill and go straight to alice in resident evil because i see resident evil all around me and i'm not just gonna be a target and let these bitches kill me remember when i was in that parking lot right in front of brooklyn pizza thank god thank hello to tribe 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 and i'm like i don't know who this is because i had i felt all the eyes all the guns all the gangs all the everything on on me and I'm like I'm like Scarface. I don't know who this is, but whoever it is, get ready to get fucked the fuck up. Now somebody said, "Well, now somebody coming." Well, yeah, you know that was just a, that was fear. That was a little fear. No, I mean I didn't mean I didn't mean to call because it, she was speaking from herself. A little bit of that is fear, but this is what you don't want me to do. You don't want me to go in fear because fear mode makes me go a certain kind of way. See, I told you I'm not one of these people that wait and pray for Jesus to come and save me. I go and start. I start rooting out who this devil is, and then I make sure. Anyway. So when I went to Guns Plus and I'm telling them um, and I'm telling them why I felt like I mm, 
why I'm telling why I'm telling them about my life. Like my like like my like my initial landlord here, like the uh like the uh uh like the Antoines. The Antoines, Mrs. Antoine has always Mr. And Mrs. Antoine, I mean Mr. Antoine was a hoot. He was, but Mrs. Antoine has always been like a, another mother to me. She is just she was just amazing. There was time I couldn't put pay my rent and she paid the rent for me. She didn't have to do that. She didn't have to do that, but she knew my situation. There are people who are kind. There are people, and, it, and they're not, and, and they're colorblind. There are people who are kind. I'm just saying, don't get caught up in colors because it can be a person that's the same color as you that be the main one that's jealous of you. Right now, I don't trust any color. I trust your energy. I'm having a little bit of PTS moment, but you know what? You know, 2007, you, you never get over it. You never get over it. If you lost a son or lost a daughter or lost a husband or lost a wife or lost any type of person that you love to, uh, to real trauma, you don't, it's so disrespectful. It's so disrespectful for somebody to say, you need to get over it. Bitch, I hope you go through that today, 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 today. Today, let's see what happens when your mother passes away. Let's see what happens when your father passes away. Let's see what happens when your daughter and your son pass away. Let's see what happens when somebody in your life gets shot down right in front of your face. Let's see you get over it. Okay? You're looking at people in the military who almost have seen people being killed every single day. Especially if you've gone to war. You've seen people blown up all over the place. And you want to wave therapy in front of their face. And they can't even get therapy because the system is against your own soldiers. What the fuck is wrong with this government? You need to just like jack this shit up from the ground up. This ain't it. This ain't it. Thomas Paine, Thomas Paine, common sense. Okay, I'm going to be Thomas Paine today. I know what y'all did to Thomas Paine, but okay, you know what? Somebody got to say it. Somebody, so I guess it's little old me, the brave little black girl, you know, with PTSD, living in Pope Plains. Bow, you say you at Pope Air Force Base. Bitch, I know what grid I'm on. Why do you think I never have to worry when the lights go off that my lights are always going to come back on? Actually, if I got about another million dollars, will I still stay in this community? I mean, I don't know. But I love the grid. I'm on, either on this or out on, on, on base. I want to be. I want to be on the Fort Bragg grid, okay? Because I I know my. I, I, it's stupid. Although they're not above that, because they did that with the goddamn tornadoes. Who? I mean, you know, I don't, we don't even talk about the tornado. I'm a weather girl, and I real, and I know, I'm seeing the weather. It's like, what is going on? And there was no warning, no warning, but some narcissistic motherfucker on base. Y'all heard that? Drunk fools tell what they do. I won't say where, but you know who you are if you're still living. But it's, literally, they said, oh, we knew. We just wanted to see how ready they were. So you turned off the radar. You turned off the alarm. You didn't let them know as these tornadoes were, were descending on Fort Bragg and Pope Air Force Base and destruction everywhere. Only until the tornadoes hit did you hear, take cover, take cover. Well, bitch, we know that. People can see. But you wanted to test their readiness. That was a fucked up move, G. People like that should never have power. People like that should never have power. It's one thing testing people under duress. But when you cause lives and millions of dollars behind that mess, and then you want to say, we're taking up money for this. No, that money went in your pocket. How many of these dams and bridges have been rebuilt from the last hurricanes? Where does that money go? North Carolina is notorious for the worst insurance ever Ever, ever. For the record, I should be on nobody's insurance policy and I ain't got one that nobody's on me. If anybody got an insurance policy and said I left them anything, you take that person instantly to jail. I shouldn't be on nobody's insurance policy because they try to kill you for insurance money. I shouldn't be on anybody's insurance policy and I didn't take out no insurance policy for nobody. I'm leaving nothing for nobody. Nothing. Nothing. Why? Can't take it with you. I know that. You're just going to scavenge it anyway, but I really ain't got that shit. I ain't really got shit to give away, so I don't give a fuck. I mean, when I'm gone, who gives a fuck? Who gets it? You know what? I have no heirs. 
And the only person that would uh, 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 get something, would have a right, would be my goddaughter. She knows who she is. And my bestie going to make sure. And everybody ain't your bestie. Hey, bestie. And did I hear somebody say, one of my, you know, one of my sisters where I shop at said, you have a I do not have a sister around here. I do not like somebody that looks like me saying she's my sister. Oh, she's trying to get, you know, she's, she's trying to get discounted. I don't know these hoes. I don't, I have, I, let the record state. I have no legal sister, no legal brothers, nobody, that whole bunch of people, that whole bunch of people that want to be my baby sis, but I don't know these sus ass bitches. Let's be real about this shit. All of y'all on the sus list to me, but getting back to, uh, the folks at gun plus and thanking you for helping me through my PTSD. So, you know, here we at the height of the racism and pandemic, pandemic, whatever it be. And I'm just like realizing, okay, this is zombie apocalypse, so I got to protect me. So I go there, but instantly, oh, God. See, this is how much I don't even like talking about guns. It's ironic that I talk about one, but in reality, when you've seen some, I don't know how you, I don't know how you, I don't know how you, I don't know how y'all play like that. You haven't gotten shot up by the right ones. I, I wish that upon you. I wish whatever you need to change you up. I hope that happens to you real soon. And it might be your child. And that's will that will and you will and you will be praying for God and praying for forgiveness, but God won't hear you. Because God knows exactly what you do. It's ironic that the people who pray to God, only God can judge me. God is judging you. So again, uh, and again, like I said, that's why I really need to visit y'all Wednesday. I need to, I need, I think I need to get out on the range again and that'll give me something to do. But uh, anyway, at the height of where, according to the media, I mean, we really didn't see here. Remember, remember how many times I go into Walmart and like, we find, I mean, you have people arguing, you have people fussing, you, you, you have you ever worked in Walmart? You see, people are stressed, people got shit going on, but I, I'm not to say that all the media is fake, but I, I'm a media person too, so I know what media will do to, scoo, to, to, to push up the pooch. I'm in media too. I mean, ratings, 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 ratings. It's just like the industry. It's just like the chart. You do what you have to do for the ratings, right? They have no heart about the money. I know a lot of people who are like, I got the, I got, I got the pandemic fever. And they got money for that. Yeah. You got money for that. You sold your own community for, uh, well, whatever. Anyway, that's what I said back to me, taking care of myself. So I go to the people at Guns Plus and tell them uh, about my situation. And right at that moment, I broke down and started crying in the middle of the store. And I just like kind of hit the floor. And, I, and, I, and I've never seen so many, it was It was so cool. I've never seen so many long hair, long haired white boys, you know, country boys, hippie boys, like the people like mountain. I mean, I just, they, these people are like the coolest of the cool. And they're all like, what did they do to you? Who did that? I'm like, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just having a moment. I'm just having a moment because, because uh, again, this was a soldier. This also was a soldier who worked and fed the MPs. You know what I'm saying? So that's why. Legacy protects legacy because good food matters. Good food matters to good MPs. You feed the MPs right, they'll be your friendly, they'll be your family for life. Baker, Sergeant Weldon Baker. Those of you who served, you know what I'm talking about. You don't get What are you going to do? No justice, no peace. I have tried to get over it. But when you constantly see this bullshit in front of you, when you constantly seeing people being shot down for nothing, when you see the pedophiles doing what they do, and when you see these people are trying to trigger me, I don't think they want to trigger me. They won't see me in my face. They don't think, bitch, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something about all of you. Let me tell you why I know there's got, there's got to be God. Let me tell you why these planes fly over me. They need to fly over me because the PTSD I have from I'm still not over my husband's murder. And the, and the whole justice system failed. Was it because I was very arrogant in your mind of what I say? Was it because of my attitude or was it, about, was it because I was truthful as fuck? Was it because I wasn't one of the ones that you could suck and fuck? I don't play politics, all right? I have integrity in me. I'm too damn good for this political game. Because y'all shit, y'all on some shit. I don't, I don't, anyway. I take care of me, okay? 
My God said, take care of me. My mom and my dad both packed a piece, so I realized I got to do the same. What would Baker do? He would tell me, go packing. And so I did. So thank you to the folks at Guns Plus who, you know, helped me take a little bit of empowerment back to me. That's why I tell anybody, wives or whatever in between, you go out on that range and, and, and get that energy out. You know, if you're not walking on Carver's Creek, you go out to Guns Plus and, you know, like, you know, take your power back. Don't go out there and be crazy. I don't think you do. Most military, most military people too smart for that. But, you know, you do have some crazy people that, but you, again, you can't get PTSD. And that's why, you know, I try to do what I do and get my energy out so you'll know what you'll see. You got a whole lot of people in military bases all over the world who feel just like me. That should scare the fuck out of some of you villains. <laughs> you think gangsters run the world? You think witches and warlocks run the world? You learn nothing from Maleficent. You learn nothing from the Matrix. You learn nothing from Alice in Resident Evil. You learn nothing from iRobot. You learn nothing from me. So now justice is going to teach you. I ain't going on your tours. Are you trying to do your last legged tours? What happens when that money runs out? And none of you whores ain't got no real job. That's why you keep in trash of the industry because you find it real easy to get back when you put nothing up at the top of these charts. Then the people will be just waiting for good music to come back. Oh, I see the setup. Bitch, you don't set me up. I'm like your mama. I'm like your grandparents. Except I'm a different one. I'm the one that would have beat your goddamn ass. Sometimes spanking, you know, baby's kids. You know, you can't put baby's kids in the timeout. You got to let baby know what you're talking about. That's why I had to put these kids in check. When those little bitches started trying to cuss me out because they got because they can cuss out that crackhead mama like that, bitch, don't play me. And I know she want to run up against everybody. I've heard like she tried to start some fight, but that bitch ain't going to start some fight with me because I'll shoot that crackhead hoe and her husband, y'all. Don't play me because I told that kid, I told you don't play with the birds. And that was the one, that's, that's the part that made me cry too. Because I said don't play with the birds because birds don't like the human touch but she did it anyway the demon seed in her and she was only three and this little bitch gonna curse at me and i'm like bitch i can take you out don't nobody care about you nobody in here for you. the dog going, whoa, whoa, whoa. what are you gonna do and the dog, whoa, whoa. ask them they'll tell you that she come but they do what they do i don't know what you do bitch you need to get your children in check but where are your children now are they sold off on the uh hispanic market somewhere mexican card i don't know I don't know. It's just sad. But the thing about it that hurt me with that, this the three oh girl. Well, I'm like, I'm like, I'm literally like trying to reach this demon child who had a lot of demons in her for obvious reasons. For obvious reasons. And I was like, why? What part of I told you don't touch the bird, don't touch the babies or the parents won't want them. And then she looked at me reminding you she was only three. So she's speaking as much as she can from her purity. And she said, but they touch me. There's sometimes you got to pull back. You can't save everybody. This is a time when you can only save yourself. But it's that type of energy that I know what people are doing to kids. That I swear I want to go John Wick on all these motherfuckers because they don't deserve to live. And then to think you want to try to test me. You want to try to roll up on me. I'm not that kid. I'm not that weak. I may be suffering PTSD. I'm still suffering from the loss of my husband. But I will fuck up a bitch. Give me a reason. I'm about justice, and it's justice season. Showing you once again why baby girl don't play. It's a legacy coming through me today. The first time I went out on the range with a gun. 
the first time. Look at the bam, 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 bam. Headshot, neck shot, neck shot. That, that's, that, 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 that's, 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 uh, what you call it, the arteries. I'm like, you hit, you cut, you hit somebody with a gun and go, that's dead, they dead. They dead, 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 dead. Dead, 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 dead. And a dick shot, couple of dick shots. I aim low, you know. Bam, 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 bam. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I only had, ironic, the number eight, I only had eight shots that didn't hit the body. I only had eight misses. Ain't that right? The number, the number, it's the numbers for me. I only had eight misses on my time on the range. And they were like, you ain't never done this before? No. You sure? Like, I would know. Like, no, not in this life. But I had a great teacher. And again, shout out to him because he was so... He was so up on telling him the story and about the murder of my husband and, and how everything. I mean, it's just some things you don't forget. And he was like, you know what? Okay, I want you to know this is what it's going to smell like. This is what the kickback is going to be. This is what, because if I don't teach you just right, you will hate guns. <laughs> I mean, you will hate, you will never, if I don't teach you just right, this could all go wrong. So you are like the best 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 teacher ever you were the you were the best you were just this was somebody that was zen real zen real uh real zen this was so tried for real so anyway and this is the second time i went out on the range okay how many one two three well you can't call it miss because i hit the body but i just hit the shoulder so it's just shoulder burns but uh one two three three Went from eight to three misses. All the rest, body shots, body shots, always a dick shot, body shot. I didn't go for the head shot. I went straight for the body. Two right in the heart, in the chest. Well, that's the heart, right? Two in the chest. I'm a sharpshooter. I love those games like Caliber and Video Games. Notice the movies that I like. I have a past life. It's taking out the bad guys. But the bad guy wants to be me. I'm not Nicki Minaj, okay? No offense to Nicki. I'm not Roman. I don't have that demon in me. If I had a demon in me, it would more be like Alexandra the Great. <laughs> the Greek is coming out of me. You better find out about that history. It's motherfucking personal, okay? I told you, I got that black Sicilian energy. That's why, I like, you know, ain't no Italians going to be fucking with me. Ain't no Jews going to be fucking with me. How are you going to fuck with me, of all people? You better check out your legacy. Ain't nobody going to cancel me today. And please believe, I do not play with the PTSD I'm on your boy served you his family on so many levels were so wrong i should have went to the brick hole gang because i bet they would have i'll bet they would have found these motherfuckers that's the only thing i regret didn't tell them what i know but i really didn't know anything so you know how do you i just know what i see but that's why when y'all were going through this hair because somebody's got ptsd so we all supposed to cut her i'm not fucking doja cat you fool Oh my God, you know what I would wish for you? I would love if all of you were put up against, like, just, just put up in front, and, and you all were target practice, and I would shoot every single one of you. That would you do easily. I'm the type of bitch that, you know what? You know, if you want me, who's the person that pulls the lever on the guilty? Me. I could do it. You can't kill like that. Did you see what I just showed you? I have PTSD. I'm big on my justice. My justice is real. Y'all just trying to cop a feel. Somebody made a sit will and they, they better sit them down. You don't know your will. You don't know mine. And if you some crazy ass African, baba, ah, baba, baba, who, baba, who, we're going to do, we're going to do some, whoo, we're going to, whoo, we're going to, whoo, whoo. You know, Haiti too. Y'all going to do some witchcraft shit on me. You going to do some voodoo doing on me. Bitch, did I show you what I would, did I, did you, didn't you see what I was studying voodoo too? I have already had the book of witchcraft. I, my mom and my, my mom and my dad took that shit away from me from seven when I got mad at what's supposed to be or seven or eight, whenever it was, when I got mad at one of my uh, 
play boyfriends and he pissed me off on Valentine's Day. And uh and I said, I hope he got hit by a car and he did I had a lot of things happen during that year and they were like, No. She's a little bit too powerful. <laughs> I thought they hit it forever, but I found it. Uh, but anyway, so I'm like, you know, whatever you are practicing today is already in me. I don't have to read those books. That energy really is in me. I just have, excuse me, I just have to channel it naturally. Look at how, look at me doing freestyling poetry. Who the fuck is this bitch that thinks she funny or funny as me? Anyway, I don't know. And, you know, and that's what I'm saying. If you paid all these hoes to mimic and mock and copy me, now what you going to pay when you ain't got no money and they ain't got no fee? I guess they're going to turn on you because if they turn on me, I'm going to channel all my PTSD and clown these motherfucking hoes. I hate it if a fake as whatever i don't give a damn where you from where you come from i don't give a damn if you're the devil self right now Ooh, tom cruise ain't got shit on me i'm bringing all you motherfuckers down that's what you get for fucking with me is there a god oh yeah oh yeah Don't mess with the military. Remember, you got a lot of people who are just like me. And what happens if they turn on you? And reminding you, there are some good people in the mafia too. There are some good people in the FBI. There are some good people in the CIA. There are some good people in the Fed. There are some bad people too. You better handle your crew. Well, like I'm saying, when I'm trying to keep your children from being raped, what the fuck are you going to do? Unless you're one of the rapers, then you better get these motherfuckers out. Because I'm telling you, you come my way, I'm gonna shoot these mother. I'm I'm letting you know, whoever comes to my house, I'm what they're gonna be. They gonna be shot dead. No qualms about that. I said what I said. I don't negotiate with terrorists. More or less, bring them to my bed. Are you stupid? But that's what you want to do. You want to gang initiate and gang rape me, bitch. I will break your dick off and feed it to you personally. You think I won't? You want to see that demon kind of out of me? P. Diddy ain't got shit on me. You don't want my eyes to go black. Because it ain't going to be because I took it in the back. It's because you, I heard the boom. I heard the boom. I heard the boom. Here comes the boom. I'm none of them. Who am I? I don't know. I'm the one up here hold, holding charcoal and incense in my hand. And blowing fire. Sparks, not fire. There's a bitch down the road doing this. Who gonna call me? So who else is gonna call me today? Who are you representing? Who are you representing, bitch? Y'all gonna get tired of this. But the more you do, I just get better and better and better and better in front of all of you. Think if I took this business seriously, I could take all your money and I might just do. Just because you didn't know when enough was enough. So now you set yourself up and you are the reason that the industry is true. Maybe they should all turn on you. Why do you keep fucking with her because it's fucking with our money? You're fucking this shit up for all of us. Yeah, blame that on these motherfuckers. Because they won't leave me alone. With their clone ass. With their crazy ass. With their crackish ass. Who the fuck you calling the represent? You know what? This is for all the people. This is all for all the Mid-Eastern people who get tired of you trying to fake this shit on them. The nerve that you call them with a fake ass Indian accent is right. You know, that's that the Kali and me saying slay all these motherfuckers instantly. Just slay them all. Don't even don't even ask nothing. Just y'all don't want me to call on Ma. And yet I already have. You have called on Ma because Ma, I mean, she like she like I've already given up everything. So it's like it's nothing for me to burn. You know, but Ma Ma makes a clean sweep. Like when that Makali energy is a clean sweep energy. It's a clean sweep. She burns everything. This earth is burning, but this earth will be fine. The irony of the forest that fire built, Carver's Creek, 
the irony of that. I want to go walking today, but I don't think my guys want me to. So I'm not going to get in the way because you are doing a lot of work today. So I get it. I'm cool. I'm resting. I'm good. I just finished eating. I'm going to take a nap. But these people keep calling me. So I'm going to show you with the burner phones and they're burning and they throw it away. But why do you even call? What is the point of even calling? What, do you just want to hear my voice? Are you that much at a loss that you just want to, why aren't you fucking your hoe? Don't you have a hoe to fuck? Don't you have a dick to suck? I thought you all that. <laughs> What's wrong with you? You want to die? Okay. I can make that happen. Not my fault though. Reminding you, you at you told God, I not I want, I I want, I don't believe she can. So I'm gonna do this until it kills me. Okay. Okay, we can make that happen, okay? But reminding you, there are a whole bunch of people in the military who feel just like I do. So what is that going to mean to all of you when you're stealing right in front of their face? How do you think they're going to feel when you have played their children out this way? How do you think you you pedophilic hoes, you Stephen Tate hoes or whatever, you, bitch, I would take your bald head and shine it with a fucking ass brick. All you motherfuckers ain't shit. You don't know me. Don't read me because I'm black. Don't read me because I'm woman. Don't read me because of whatever you think I am. You think you so clever, but what you don't know is I don't give a damn. Bitch, I'm going to be all up your ass. Even in your dreams, I'm going to watch you not pass because I want you to go through this over and over and over again. Eternal damnation fire every fucking day. How is she holding this in her hand? Ain't it burning her hand? I don't know. By the way, what must I be? Mm -hmm. You all are the anomaly. That's what you say. Everything I am, you are. So who are the anomalies around here? Who's doing me in reality? Who? Show me who. Let me know. Let me see it. Put it down there. Put it down here. Show me who. Show me who and I'll support that cat. Show me who's doing me around here and I will support that cat. I want to know. Maybe I miss somebody, yo. So who exactly is doing me? But you got to show me this. You got to show me in reality. Bitch, don't put up a picture or a little something you get on TikTok. I want to see that constant walk. Otherwise, shut the fuck up because anyone who steals my identity is dead motherfucking dead, 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 dead dead can you spell the word dead <laughs> oh poetic justice indeed shit man why do they keep fucking with me people kept saying are you the reaper i might be mm -hmm. it's something i don't want to see in me but my dad definitely if you messing with daddy's girl dad we daddy will definitely reaper on you and by the way, Hollywood industry, you do owe me for mama. You you do owe me. I want my creator fee. I want my creator fee for the creator. I want my creator fee for Ahaska, Ahsoka, whatever it is. I want my creator fee for all this music and all this whatever you're trying to do. See, I get it. I really do. I don't know if you air tag me. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a collective mind fucking thing that you do. I don't know if it's a mind fuck cerebro thing. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a higher thing. I don't know if it's a demonic thing. But what I do know is you're going to pay me my goddamn money. That I know. One way or the other, you gonna pay. Because I ain't the hoe. In this game of pimps and hoes, bitch, I am not the hoe. What the fuck you talking about? All right. My battery should be running out. So, and I'm just sitting here lighting incense. Who gonna call me next? I'm gonna keep putting it on the phone. Just to show you how they won't leave me alone. But yet, are you seeing how it's affecting me? Remember, I just talked through my PTSD. And I got my therapy every day. I can go outside and take my bird app and listen to the birds, okay? So that's what I'll probably do. Why was I kept saying it's Tuesday, it's Tuesday, it's Tuesday? I'm a day ahead of you. I think because maybe I was looking forward to tomorrow and stuff, and I'm really looking forward to the weekend. 
whoo, hanging out with some real people where I can breathe with real friends. I'm getting a whole new group of people, and I don't give a damn if any of them look like me. But this is what you won't do. You won't fuck around and use me. Did I finish the story about why I did not cut my hair when all y'all were cutting off your hair like Jada Pinkett Smith because and, and Willow because we're all trying to support some crazy ass bitch? Fuck you, ho. I'm saying I'm keeping my hair because my hair reminded me that the best people I knew in Atlanta were dreads. And even though they were saying, come home, come home, come home, I couldn't. I could. I should have. Because Atlanta, ironically, has always shown me more love than North Carolina has ever shown me in reality. Atlanta, you know, Atlanta is what it is, but Atlanta ain't the gold mecca either. Let me tell you, there's some fuckery in Atlanta. I mean, everything, 99% of Atlanta is, Atlanta is not the black mecca. 99% of Atlanta is such as hell. But in any way, it's, why, it's how you have to move out of your own hometown, okay? Because you are, uh, remind, reminding you, a uh, uh, prophet in your own hometown is never recognized. Never, never. So I get it. I get it. I get it. But you know, because my husband, after my husband being murdered, they all rallied around me and said, come home, come home to us. And I couldn't because just about everybody that I held in high regard, not everybody, but most of the people I held in high regard in Atlanta had lots. And at this point, I couldn't, I couldn't stand to look at people with lots. For like about three or four years, I looked at everybody with lots either in fear or wondering if you were the one who shot my husband. See, right now, I mean, some there could be some right around me. They could, they could be some of the ones that did it. Honestly, I don't know because the killer was never found. But I'm saying, bitch, if you felt like, you know, you didn't finish the job, you don't want to come around me because if you're wondering if I'm still feeling some kind of way. Yeah, I've had that talk with God on many levels. Like, you got to let that go, baby. How can I let that go, daddy, when they keep wanting to roll up in my face? These are some other people, all right? One way or another, your case has been handled. And that's another thing with this PAC thing. I don't trust the government enough to do. I'm going to wait since I don't have to respond for another year. Because anything the government is doing right now, I, I, I think it's really kind of strange. You want me to redo all of my shit, all of my paperwork. Like my husband had to Fight just for 90% when he should have been had 100%. Think if I had 100% what I could do. So I've been playing this out hard in front of all of you here at my hometown. What home is it to me when they steal everything and say they are the big celebrity? Y'all fuck off, fuckers. All y'all can miss me. But uh, how many people did my husband help? And yet you took, you know what? Mm, mm, mm. Fuck you people on Mercs and Road. You know what I'm talking about. And I grew up, I know the real Mercs and Road. You don't, or you do. Mercer, I remember what I remember what you did to my dad. I remember what you did to my mom. When I think I kinda like wait, hey, who who retrograde. I remember what you did to my family, what you did to my husband, what you did to my mom, what you did to my dad, and what you did to me. Actually I really should go and kill everybody. The voices in my head said, now I'm acting like uh what's the name? Holly Holly Quinn. In real life, fuck Barbie. And by the way, I had a Barbie. I had all kinds of dolls. And I actually made my own Barbie. I didn't tell my mom. My, we, they gave me anything. Yeah, everything. But I didn't tell them to buy me all that fancy ass Barbie clothes. I was just, yeah. I literally, I learned from my aunt how to sew hand and needle style. Not with a, not with a, a sewing machine. Because, man, I kept seeing people at K Friends STEM again. Like, like, no, I did not take home that. I'm like, everybody was getting, you know, jabbed with a needle. And so I'm like, I'm not doing that. I took shop. <laughs> I took shop. Always remember, Archie comic series, I am always Betty. Not Veronica. I am always Betty. Betty ain't missing anyone. But I'm just saying, so Betty knows how to fight. Betty knows how to shoot. Betty knows how to fish. Betty knows how to kick your motherfucking ass. Betty's not Veronica. Uh, what about, where's Richie? Where's Archie? Betty ain't, Betty, Betty, this Betty ain't crying for no guy. And when I'm not chasing no guy, and like, well, it's Archie and Reginald. I don't give a fuck, okay? I'm happy being me. I can be a party all to myself. I don't need anybody. Look at me. I'm talking to myself now, but not really. There are a whole bunch of eyes on me. Without a fall. Here we go. And here we go. Hello? This is Valerie Baker. 
I'm good. How are you? Yeah, my next check will come uh, on the 20th. So I'm going to catch up then. Yes, ma'am. And, and thank you guys for being so, you guys are the coolest. Thank you guys for working with us. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Bye-bye. I make personal relationships with my bank. Uh, Brag Mutual, by the way, I salute to these people. They are the greatest. I love myself some Brag Mutual. They, they, what, what are they supposed to do? Change their name to Liberty Mutual? You already have a Liberty Mutual, so that's not going to happen. Y'all stupid. With this name, this was so much money for a name change, for a stunt. This money could have went in better places. Every soldier who's a real soldier knows that. Every veteran who's a real veteran knows that. The only ones who would say, I feel some kind of way, then they must be taking the money or the fee to be an instant celebrity. And they just want to be like, what? You want to be like the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air? Fresh Prince don't care. Jay-Z don't care. Nobody cares. Your mayor don't care. You know who cares? The military care. You know who cares? I care. I care about these soldiers on base. I care about these soldiers that you don't, you don't know what they face. I care about these soldiers when you got in a locker, you got one that feeds the birds on the top of his barracks, and you got another one that's got dead crows in his locker. But you want to take away the real chaplains and the real therapists, and they can't even go to people because, you know, you're a soldier. You got to, you know what, y'all Y'all are pushing the wrong people. And you're going to wait to these fake-ass celebrities, these fake-ass entertainers, these fake-ass people who are literally destroying the economy just for a shit show and views. They're whoring your children out, too. And you say, I'm the person with the problem, and I'm proving it right in front of you. What more am I supposed to do? Does truth not live here anymore? Okay, fine, do you. But, bitch, if you come to me, you're going to be a dead, dead, dead whore, dead whore, dead whore. No, let me say it in your vocabulary, dead hoe. Because I know most of you are slow. With your non-brilliant ass. Back the fuck up. But anyway, I do good business with my people. So my people know me personally. They know. I'll let them know if when I can pay it and when I can't pay it. They work with me. As long as you're working with people and not running from people. As, le as long as you're legal and being about it. They will do business with you. Everybody understands this. We've all had these moments. We are, Every true billionaire, millionaire who really started from scratch. Believe me, they just didn't be a millionaire like that. The real ones, the real builders of legacy, they started after they had many tragedies and they had to start from scratch. So I'm in a real legacy. That's why I'm out there on Rockefeller land. You don't know how they had to fall back. You see this, 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 that, and this and what you know, but you don't know the whole story, do you know? I know the fact that that lady that stayed out there, their cook or their, or, 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 or their maid, she lived for the rest of her days until she didn't live no more. That's taking care of people. You take care. Salute to the people who take care of the people who take care of you but you want to come out and didn't they have slaves bitch they had workers i don't know maybe everybody had slaves i mean it was during that time but i know these people live well these people live better than some of you some of you billion ass rappers living in a fucking band or living in a oh yeah you living in an apartment in new york with the rats and roaches that's costing you two thousand dollars a month and you don't have two thousand dollars a month money that's why you trying to get these shoes and making everybody pay two hundred or three hundred or four hundred dollars for a fucking pair of shoes why that's a bill. That's a car note. Why the fuck would I pay money for some shoes when I got a car to pay? Oh, but I guess I'm supposed to scam and get a hoe to pay. Y'all need to back the fuck off me. I'm not doing it this way. Nope. 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 Somebody need to hear this today. All of this is right in line. Again, though, uh, military people, Brad, uh, Brad Mutual Credit Union, tell them Val Jones Baker sent you. They are the best, the best, the best, the best, the best, the best, the best. I like these people. They're the best.
They're the best. I can't say that about everybody, but I can say that about my people that I deal with on camera. You know, everything from, from here to Cameron, past the gates, I can't even say. Past the gates of Fort Bragg, I don't, you know what, my own, uh, the, the only, the only reason, it was two reasons, the only reason why I go on, 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 on Merkson Road was because of food, and now the ownership changed, and you could tell instantly, the ownership, they're tacky, they're tacky, they're rude, the shit went up, I have no reason to go on Merkson Road for shit, other than just passing through going to the beach. Uh, I need to find, by the way, I need to find a good tax rep because I have a, I have a tax prepared, but I'm, I told you I don't do Merkson Road. It's just energy. It's like, it's like, it's like Sodom and Gomorrah and Lot. Again, it's energies. Don't, don't, don't take it a different kind of way. I'm, I'm strictly speaking energy. When you realize something that salted you, why would you go back? So there's nothing left for me on Merkson Road at all. That's like Sodom and Gomorrah to me. After my food place went, oh, well, then shit, that's it. <laughs> I have absolutely no reason to ever uh, patronize anything on Merkson Road past those gates ever again. But you do you. You know, if that works for you, then let it work for you. But it don't work for me. But I am looking for a tax preparer because I did have one. And she's, she's but I can't go to visit her. Maybe she can come and visit me. I guess I could, I, I guess I could call and see because I ain't going there. Y'all bitches owe me. You owe my parents. You owe my family. My family owes me. My own family. Y'all can have all that. Y'all can have all of that. I'm going to let the hurricanes clean that out. Maybe once the hurricanes and the floods clean that out again. We'll see. But uh, not right now. Not for a while. Mom and dad said nope. Grandma said no. Grandma. Both grandmas. But your grandma has let my grandma, my grandmothers have many things. Do you want to know what my grandmothers really think of you? <laughs> I don't think you do. Anyway, that was it. That was kind of, that came right on time because it was about business. See, that's how I do business. But some of y'all, you know, I just let her know, like, you know, when my, when my check comes in. That's why I send my bank notes when my check comes in. My banks know if I like if I if I get overdrawn or something like that, they know that they're gonna get their money. The SBA knows they're gonna get their money eventually, but I'm still trying to figure out how the rich people you give grants to, how the drug dealers you give grants to, how the strip clubs you give grants to. But I'm having to pay back my loan as a small business person, as a real business. How these people got fifty thousand businesses in their name and ain't got shit to show for it. But you gave them a grant? Did they suck your dick or your clip? I'm just saying. Who who I remember like like I used to say up at BC Broadcasting. Who did that? Then I know there was Nikki that said no. It didn't. No, it was Nikki that said that because I was saying that too. And she was like, "Who do I have to fuck to get heard around here?" I mean, it's like it's like that. That's bad when you're working at a radio station and you can't get justice because you ain't you know, unless you suck or fuck the uh the, the program director. Oops. Who got a problem with me today? Who turned on me today? When you didn't have to, and I took care of your kids, but you holier than thou, stupid ass bitch. You above all owe me apology. And they know exactly who I'm talking to. Nah, Heffa, no. But I don't expect that to you. You never expect the devil to go high. Because the devil's going to do what a devil do. But understand this. You bitches are trying to double down on me today. But hear me. <laughs> you double down. I triple down. Officer Hooty on TikTok. I love you with Scoot. <laughs> Scoot. Now that's somebody I follow. Officer Hooty. Hooty. Me and Sc me, I want to meet Scoot. <laughs> but maybe not. You have a problem. She's an older black person of my daughter. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I want to be scoot. You, I'm looking at you like, is that this kind of stuff I put my daddy through? <laughs> so thank you for making me laugh. I'm going.
going to go and check you out. No, but Scoot's a hoot. Uh, but yeah, I, I can relate to Scoot. Yes, Tom Boys rock. Tom Boys rock. Tom Boys rock. So I remember what you said. You know, like, when they want to go low, you go low. You damn right. That's what we do. Salute to you. Salute to those who are not afraid to slay a motherfucking demon in your face at your place, bitch. You don't have to come for us. We want to come for you. I'm in scoop mode today. Uh, okay. Uh, or maybe scoops in Val Jones mode today. Anyway, that's it. I'm done. I'm through. Unless somebody else is going to call me. But that was a good call. So see how it balances out. I could have been mad. And I could have been angry. And I went through all my emotions. But when I, but I answered that phone professionally. You saw that. You saw that. So, but you know, if you got somebody like trying to cheat and stuff like that, they're going to, we'll see. There's people say, well, she's unstable. She said, she said, then how am I doing business? How am I paying my own bills? How am I doing business with my two? I have two banks, by the way, two. Now I deal business with. They know how my money rolls. That's why when you know you send me some crazy, you send me some crazy uh, insurance check from Ohio, unemployment check from Ohio, and they and they kick that shit back. It's like she ain't been in Ohio. She don't work in Ohio. She ain't been in Ohio. She never worked in Ohio. No, no, I love my, they were, y'all were trying to send some weird shit in my bank account, and which I'm pretty sure had I, number one, had I accepted it, then I would have been set up, because that was set up right there. Number two was somebody, just, you, you send that back, you were supposed to, I'm not going to take an a, a insurance fraud check from Ohio, bitch, I don't play games like that, I don't play, I am like too, uh, mm -mm. I'm too legal ease, okay, jail is, I don't, I don't know why some of y'all have to go to jail before you realize, I don't really want to go to jail, nah, nah, I mean, look at Thugger Thugger. Thugger didn't think he was going to go to jail. Thugger ain't up, up in there now. Thugger ain't getting out. Tory Lanez ain't either. Remember, they all bad, bad, bad bitches. Bad this, bad that, bad whatever. Until you get into jail and you find what the bad bitches are. I mean, on both sides. Mm. But the industry was going to save you, right? The industry ain't saving nobody. Who's saving Beyonce and P. Diddy? Ain't nobody saving them. Or J.C. They can't even save them. They don't know. They think the industry is going to sell them. The industry has sold them as a sit shit show. They're trying to put all their assets in their, in their children, you know, in their children's safe what they owe to everybody else. No, bitch, don't play me, yo. Like you haven't had Meek Mill. Do you know? You, I know who Meek Mill is. I know who Kendrick Lamar is. I know who you said, you know, this. I, I wrote all the songs for Kendrick. Did you really? So what was that supposed to mean to me? Fuck it. Fuck it, bitch. Prove to me. Who are you really? Y'all have tried to do some of the dumbest shit to me to figure out who I am. And here I am sitting in my authenticity, being everything that I can be. But now you looking at me. One thing you see, I'm not running away, running out the country, hiding from anybody. I'm answering the goddamn phone. There was a time that I didn't answer the phone because I just said, these motherfuckers ain't going to leave me alone. Now I'm answering all calls and I'm letting them know this motherfucker call me. This motherfucker call me. This number is sus. This number is sus. This motherfucker you can't trust. And I, 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 goodbye. How many times you going to call up with the automated goodbye? Then goodbye then. How many times you've been telling me goodbye since last Thursday? Or either the Thursday before that. How many times do you say goodbye and mean fucking goodbye? It's goodbye, hello to you in the world. Hello, hello. I dun 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 dun. dun. All of a sudden, I'm thinking of the Beatles song. Why is that? I don't know. But anyway, that's it. Because I'm sure my, uh, I'm sure this, I'm sure that the, uh, I'm sure that this battery is about to wear out. See how this turned into a whole other Ranger Manger show. I know my folks just love the hoot out of me. I'm like the best he could stay shit on TV. Everything is reruns. Nothing is new. All these old shows ain't shit. And the ones that they're trying to do. Oh, God, that's horrible. They're horrible. The scripts are horrible. And like I said, Star Trek, the reboot. Fuck that shit. What kid could it going to do? No, we ain't doing that. To that degree, I will support uh, William Shatner on that. We ain't doing none of that shit. Nope. Nope. That's a fail. I didn't even Rebecca, and I didn't even, like. This is Rebecca Rum, Rummagen, Rummagen. Like, like, ugh. It didn't even look like you, and she wasn't even a man. I'm just like, wow. Be actress, be actress, be actress, and like, no. And then, and 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 then, and, and then the little wizard, I'm the wizard, you know. To, pop, 
somebody threw that ball. Yeah, how many bottles, how many balls gonna be thrown at people when they get on stage? Everybody ain't playing that shit, okay? And these people, you I'm like, is this the next person? You know, Drake signs, so Drake signs T so touchdown. Number one. Everybody's T T, right? T T T D T D T T T T. Y'all playing the narrative like crazy. Bitch, don't come for me. I'm talking to all of you right now. You know who I be. Good kid goes bad. Bitch. I'm still in the hood. And living comfortably. Ask yourself why. I'm not hiding. I have my doors open. And my gun loaded. Ask my neighbors how I am in real life. Ask my neighbors what they think of me. Ask my numbers, am I making up what I say and who I be? Ask some of these kids that maybe at least one I made it. If I made a good impression on one, then that's all I needed to do. Just save one. And I think I at least saved two. So now, 2023, it's all about saving me. But what you're not going to do is make me go crazy and gang stalk me like you did, Twitch. Bitch, I'm not Twitch. I'll come up all in your ass, bitch. I might be that witch. Maleficent is real. Maleficent was good witch, Ramona. Oh, yeah. And it's, 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 um, it's, uh, Wizard of Oz time. The best, the best and most gangster fairy of all was Glinda. And that's where the battery starts to run out. Good way to end on. On the good ship. We ain't doing the good ship, Lollipop. That's y'all. Y'all tricked even uh, Shirley Temple out. My God. Hollywood industry is so wicked. You trick out these kids. You trick out everybody. That's why I never wanted to be a part of you. But you going to make me? Because I have talent? Because my talent scares you? So you want to suck my soul, suck it dry, and wear me too? Bitch, I'll dance in your grave. That, I promise you. Or maybe not. Anyway, I gotta go. PTSD kids. But I'm handling it with my therapy, yo. Somebody will learn from me. You just gotta find a flow that works for you. Salute to my troops. I love you. Seriously. I'm here for you. Like you're here for me. We are fire, right? Salute to the real top guns. Y'all are sexy as shit. Who wants a broke down rapper actor when you can have all of this? Just keep sending those helicopters and those planes through, boys. I love it. My toys are a little bit different than y'all's toys. <laughs> I know. No, no, no. But yeah. Oh, ooh. I, my love language is different. Anyway, I gotta go. Peace. Gotta love my military. I do. I really do. Thank you. Maybe coffee tomorrow. How about that?